Paper plates, uh, for me, they're a metaphor for the human life. Just like the paper plates are disposable, they're made to be disposed. But for me, specifically this piece, uh, because it has so much of the Christian faith in it, uh, just like we are made in the image of Christ, the paper is made from the tree. It is a complete physical transformation of the tree um, into the paper form. So especially in this installation, all that comes together. Starting with carving the wood block with the imagery that I wanted um, and then printing on about 3,000 paper plates is what this piece had in different colors. Some of the colors are based on the colors of this business, uh, but others are more neutral colors. And then sealing those paper plates with an acrylic so that it, it has a little more lasting quality. Then at the side, once I came to the side, I had to, you know, I spent a few time, few hours um, thinking about the space, thinking about how the patients will sit and how the light would come into the room. And then I started creating the wire form first for a couple of days. And once that was done, I started plugging the paper plates in. And after working on it for a day, it just didn't feel what I wanted to say, it didn't feel right. And so with the same form, I just twisted the, the cables that I used. And once it clicked in place, I remember it was 12.45 at night. And it clicked and I said, okay, now I get to start my piece. And I knew that was the night I would be working all night. That was the night I did work all night. Uh, because I was so excited, I finally got the form that, that would work. It was exhausting to get that done because I had to use an electric ladder to go up and down, up and down. And when you're working this close to the piece, high above, you don't know how it's going to look. So you have to come down and then look up again to see what, what the final view would be. Uh, but I was really satisfied with the way it turned out. It changes the way it looks depending on where you look from. Even downstairs, there are three or four different views and your interpretation could change completely based on where you are looking at it from, so I was excited. As I keep working, I see what I don't need and I start editing. And especially for this one, because it was a circle, I could start from one end and I start editing from one end and then go back when I reached the other side, I knew that I had finished editing. And then one last look from the floor and I realized it was done.